Hello students, today we shall learn some special graphs. I am going to cover four kinds of special graphs here. The first one, let's say I have an equation like this, suppose x is equal to 3. And you all know how to find points here. So I have, I have to take two variables x and y. The problem over here in this equation is that there is no y. So how to solve this kind of question? Your value of x will always be 3. And the y, you can take any value. Let's say I am taking 0, minus 2 and 2. So that these are my three points A, B and C. Now, if I draw the system, you all know how to draw the system and draw the graph, right? So if I draw the system, this is my x-axis and this is my y-axis. And if I now try to plot the points, so 3, 0, this is my A. And I have 3, minus 2, so this is my b and i have 3 comma 2 so this is my c and if i join the points i am going to get a graph like this right now what is interesting over here this graph is parallel to parallel to y axis isn't it can you see this the graph is parallel to the y axis right so the, what is the summary you have to learn from here if I have a equation like x is equal to any constant, let's say constant means any number, then this graph is always parallel to y-axis. Alright, so this is the first kind of special graph. Any equation in the form x equal to some number, x equal to constant is going to be parallel to y-axis. Now let us take another kind of equation. Let's say I am taking an equation y equal to minus 2. So what will happen over here? This time my y is fixed as minus 2 and I am going to take any value for x, right? So these are my three points a, b and c. So if I draw the system now, considering x axis and y axis and the origin, so this is my origin x, x this, y, y this. And if I plot the points, so I have 0 comma minus 2 so this is my a I have 1 comma minus 2 so this is my b and I have 2 comma minus 2 this is my c and if I join these points by a graph I get this kind of line and as you can see this graph is parallel to x axis right the summary is if I have an equation like y equal to constant something like this this graph is always going to be parallel to y axis so x equal to c parallel to y axis y equal to c parallel to x axis that's all you need to learn from this special graphs part one